hi everyone welcome back to the laravel 6.0 video tutorial and in this video we are going to learn about the routings so these are some keys point key points that we are going to cover in this video so first of all we will learn theoretically what is the routing then we will create a new routing page a new routing with the page then uh, we will learn that how we can use the anchor tag for routing then pass the data pass the parameter and at the last we will see that how we can use the redirection also so now first question is what is the routing so when you just and pass some url here like welcome then some particular page will be open and on this url so this is the routing so for now i'm just going to hit it and it will give the 404 that means there is a no routing set for this page all right so if i just uh, want to set for this uh, routing for this page then I have to do some code and now let's learn and start with the routing so as you know that for the routings we have to perform all operations in the routing so, uh, routers folder with the web.php in the upcoming video I'm just going to cover the all the three things also but for now just open the web.php and start working with that so let's say I just want to use the welcome uh, also so I can just put here welcome and if you just uh, try to refresh it then you can see that we are able to see this page so this is basics basically the routing theory now let's implement something uh, nice so uh, for now I just uh, first of all I'm just going to make a new routing file uh, as you can see that this is our the uh, second thing so for that I have to create a uh, one more uh, page so I'm just going to open the resource folder and inside it just click on the views folder and create a new file so i'm just going to create a user dot play dot php all right and hit the enter and i'm just going to write here an h1 tag and write here users will be placed here all right so for that i have to make a route for this so for this I'm just going to make a route which which is the route colon get and we will learn everything about the what is the route what is the get and all all right so just going to write here user and just call a callback function here and just return view and you can write here users all right now let's try with the user oh sorry that's my bad just choose with the user and now you can see that we are able to uh, see the another screen here all right so the second thing also cover so now how we can pass the anchor tag so uh, let's say uh, on the user i just want to make an anchor tag and in this anchor tag i want to open the welcome.php page so I'm just going on here and here I'm just going to make an anchor tag and here I can just write here my URL which is the welcome all right and just write here open welcome is simply right here and just refresh it then you can see that there is a no you now you are here so for that I can just uh, click on it this okay so i just have to pass here welcome to make it route all right so i'm just going to click here now you can see that the, this page is open on the link here all right and we can come back on the same page also if i just put here same thing on the welcome page just put the here and i'm just going to simply write here user and just open user it base all right so whenever i'm just going to click on it then you can see that we can come back on the same page all right so this is uh, how we can use the anchor tag with the routing so now let's uh, go with the third point some pass some data with the routing all right so let's say uh, with the routing i want to pass uh, uh, with the user i want to pass a username also so how can i do that for the second parameter i can just use the array and in the user i can just write here user and 
just use it uh, simply like this as an array like Peter okay and the user screen I can just uh, use a PHP tag and I can just write here print underscore R and just write here user all right and now let's see you can see that Peter is here all right so this is also nice so now let's cover up the next thing uh, how we can pass the parameters so let's say you want to pass some parameters here like the user user have id like 101 you would want to pass this also how we can, you can do this so for that uh, just come back to the welcome.php file and here you just have to write here uh, inside the brackets uh, id and uh, with the id you can just simply pass here dollar id parameter here also and just return simply here uh, user just you can simply return here dollar id all right so now let's see okay so there is some error let me check here One maybe uh, I think I just forgot to put here uh, slash here and now let's check now you can see that we got this ID here so if I just put something here more complex then you will are able to see here also all right so all right and at the last how we can uh, use a redirection here so let's see it also so if you want to just put here route and in the route you can use a redirect function in the redirect function just put the two parameters fun one for which are what uh, what URL that you want to put on the uh, URL bar address bar and second one where you want to place it so you can just place it inside the user or let's say on the welcome all right uh it's a redirect so just put here t also and i'm just going to put here just refresh it and just put it here here and you can see that whenever i'm just going to put it here it will automatically react on the welcome base that's also good so let's say you want to push the uh, put the parameters uh just, just put the user and this ID should be the optional let's say that how you can uh, make it optional for that you can just write here uh, colon here and uh, you can put some default text also like uh, the default text no data passed and when you just pass some data okay let me check once more yep I just have to use this inside the brackets okay so if I just uh, remove it then you will see that the it will show me that no data is passed here all right so this is the way that how you can make it the optional and now what is that get so get is the method that can handle only the get request so you can use here a uh, main things so uh, the method that uh, they are used with the routing is a uh, route with the post when you just send the post method delete and put options any there is a lots of request uh, if you want to see the old request then you can uh, visit the link which is given inside the description box and don't forget to subscribe my channel if you think that uh, you have to learn inside the routing and you want to ask them you can ask me inside the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching this video